Welcome back, you guys. Guess what I have? Well, obviously, an unboxing or two or three. I'm going to use the 269 to open these. Let's start with the one in the middle. Why not? It's as good as any. So excited. Let's do that. Okay. Watch for peanuts. Oh, I got a Civiti here. That's funny because I don't, I don't know which one it is, honestly. I'm an idiot. All right. Oh, yay! Finally. All right. Wait till you guys see. This is awesome. I'm so happy about this. This is friggin' awesome. The typical paraphernalia from Saviti. Good stuff. Stickers. Love it. And this little guy right here. Oh my goodness, finally. Oh, let's see. Oh. <laughs> All right. Let's just slow roll it, shall we? Oh my gosh, look at how cute. But I'm so glad they came out with this color combination because this is what my original banter is in as well. So they match. Let me show you. Poof. Check it out. They're so cute. I love them. This is awesome. How cool. Ooh, that does have great ergos. This thing is tiny. Man, adding that forward finger choil was genius. Wow, very cool. Very cool. I love it. Let's see. Oh, there you go. That's how you do it. Let's see. It's very smooth. I like this little guy. So cute. Let's see over there <laughs> they're so cute all right let's move on shall we all right close this up oh, it. let's get into it with the baby banter oh man how cool what a great like load uh don't be thinking anything weird by me saying what a great load, because I didn't mean it like that. I'm not a weirdo. Well, I'm a weirdo, but not that kind. So this is going to be the first time I've ever gotten beat up boxes, but it's not that big of a deal. So we have the 237 and the 261. I don't know what the S1 means, but I guess we'll find out. What is the 237? Let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, I know which two these are. Yes, yes. Yes, yes, y'all. I get so excited on unboxing days. Check it out. Woohoohoo. And they're cold, fresh out the box. Ooh, that's a nice ergo. This thing has great ergos, and you can still choke up on the Ricasso. Man, that's awesome. Let's try the front flipper, shall we? Oh, I can see a problem with it already. Well, <laughs> yeah, that's not going to work. So the jimping is uh, completely wrong on this. Uh, it's not. You need to go up there for the flipper and I can see that if I do go up that high this flipper tab is gonna hit my finger so that's okay I'll see if I can eventually start flipping it but today I'm on my lunch break so I don't have that much time beautiful it's gorgeous nice milling great beautiful beautiful We'll have to figure it out later, though. Ooh, gosh. <laughs> the 
great, great action on that. All right. Oh, got another one here. Let's see here. Two sixty one S one. Oh my gosh! All right, let's. Oh, this one. Yes, the Apex. Ooh, that's pointy right there. You don't want to choke up on that. Oh my gosh! Another one with great ergos, you guys. Whoa. Wow, it's bigger than I thought it would be. Wow, that's what she said. <laughs> okay, that was my dad joke of the day. I'm gonna wipe this off a little bit. Let's see. This thing is gorgeous. I love this knife. I just, I guess this has been out for a while, but I just came across it on White Mountain Knives and I thought, oh my goodness, that's gorgeous. So, I decided to grab it, and um, in the looks department, this thing is killing it, so that is great so far. Let's see. Ooh, great action. Great. It's pretty deep in there. Check that out. It's a pretty aggressive um, Bowie style or clip point blade, whichever you prefer to call it. I love the palm swell. This is perfect. It sits in the palm very well. Ooh, man, this is nice. It would be, I think this thing would have been amazing with a hollow grind, though. Just looking at it right now, yeah, I think this would, a, a hollow grind would suit this knife so perfectly. With that aggressive clip point, I like that. Oh, but I'm sure it'll be just as slicey great knife so far can't even feel that pocket clip you can feel it but it just lays in the palm of your hand just right boy the placing is perfect check it out goes right in the middle oh wow I am really impressed with this one so far I'll be taking this one back I'm gonna switch my EDC for the day because right now I'm carrying the 269 and the um, can, Concept Fusa. I love this little thing. It's cool. It's got great action. It, you know, it's really simple. Great micarta. So I'll be doing a, a full review on it, though. Don't worry, guys. All right, on to the next one. Let's see what's going on over here. don't know what this one is at all. Another Tucson. Okay, this one does not have the number on the outside of the box, but that's okay. Not a big deal. I usually just write it on anyway. I'm glad they started labeling them, to be honest. Oh, the Eagle. Yes. Oh. Oh my gosh, you guys. Check out that stone wash wow it's gorgeous beautiful so this one i believe is uh 14c 28n a mazwan mokhtar design and a beautiful stone wash way to go tucson that's amazing that's amazing i love this the eagle has the eye here it looks like an eagle if you ask me it's it's beautiful the handle's all smooth, but it's not too so smooth that it's going to slip out of your hand. The... I don't know about that. <laughs> we'll see. Mazwan Mokhtar does some interesting things as far as the pocket clip and the ball that it rests on, the way it rests. It's just... It's, it's a little strange sometimes. I'm going to try it out real quick. Oh, wow, that one's not a problem at all. So this one, as far as I'm concerned, is right up the alley that it should be up. Anyway, you guys, uh, that was a 10-minute unboxing. 
lots of fun. Thank you for joining me, and I will see you soon.